Trafficking Movement held a workshop today on how to help trafficking victims. Also, a look into the number of oil trains running through our state capital. And a North Dakota high schooler overcomes one of life's biggest obstacles and rises to the top of her class. KMOT at 10 starts now. You're watching The Night Report at 10 on NBC North Dakota News, your news leader in high definition. North Dakota's U.S. Senators pushed the Pentagon to continue to the Air Force's nuclear efforts. Good evening, I'm Sarah Anwar. And I'm Joe Skrzeski. Thanks for joining us tonight. The Senators join members of Task Force 21 to push leaders in Washington to support the Nuclear Force Improvement Program. It is critically important that we continue to remind and to visit with the Pentagon about the importance of long-range bomb bombers and the important role that the, the missiles play in the nuclear triad um, in defense of our country. In our Appropriations Committee, we included almost $200 million for upgrades to the air launch cruise missile. Very important system, which is delivered by the B-52. Both senators have worked with leaders in Washington to reinforce the Air Force's nuclear efforts, including the Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles, or ICBMS. Now it's time to get a quick check on weather. Meteorologist Amanda Linquist joins us now. Amanda, whatever you did to, keep such, to get such a nice day, keep it up. Uh, yeah, I wish I could take credit for the good weather, but I guess I'd have to take the blame for the bad weather. Then, too. Oh, I don't want to okay. do that, but it was beautiful out there, fantastic evening. 